Achondroplasia is a disorder of bone growth that causes the most common type of dwarfism. Achondroplasia may be inherited as an autosomal dominant trait, which means that if a child gets a defective gene from one parent, the child will have the disorder. If one parent has achondroplasia, the child has a 50% chance of getting the disorder. If both parents have the condition, the child's chances increase to 75%. Symptoms include abnormal hand appearance with persistent space between the long and ring fingers, bowed legs, decreased muscle tone, disproportionately large head to body size difference, and a prominent forehead, shortened arms and legs, especially the upper arm and thigh, and a short stature significantly below the average height for a person of the same age and sex. Spinal stenosis and spine curvatures called kyphosis and lordosis. Complications can be clubbed feet or fluid buildup in the brain. People with achondroplasia seldom reach 5 feet in height. Intelligence is in the normal range. Infants who receive the abnormal gene from both parents do not often live beyond a few months. There is no specific treatment for achondroplasia. Related abnormalities, including spinal cord stenosis and spinal cord compression, should be treated when they cause problems. There is no true cure for achondroplasia. Genetic counseling may be helpful for prospective parents when one or both have achondroplasia. However, because achondroplasia most often develops spontaneously, prevention is not always possible.